uh, probably drove you and I to a point to say that we was going to have to create an organization a reflective of what he was talking about. Oh, the fact that Malcolm uh, said I, uh, that by legal today, constitutional right, the Second Amendment, every black man and woman, and black person in this country had a right to have a shotgun in their home to defend themselves from unjust attacks by racism, which is one point that influenced us very much. But what influenced us even more was Malcolm's emphasis that we must have a political organization that dealt most immediately with the housing and the clothing and shoes and food for the people. That while we deal with this, ultimately, the revolutionary process will go on and it will probably still be somewhat of a violent revolution. As you know, even in this period, although there's, there's, there's numerous violence still being committed against black people,